I just like to spend time together and talk about anything, no matter what we're doing, no matter if it's quilting or shopping <laughs> or traveling. I am Kelsey Cooley and this is my mom, Janie. I am a CPA, I'm a daughter and I quilt. So we are in Flint, Texas on Lake Palestine. It's near Tyler, Texas. Um, and this place is just really comfortable for me. I like to spend time here. Me and my husband come here a lot on the weekends and my husband will watch football with my dad and whenever the weather is nice, we'll go outside and play games. Um, we fish out on the dock. Um, it's just a really comfortable place. It almost feels like we're on vacation when we're here. She kind of picked it up and started quilting and then that's something that I wanted to do again so I started yeah. quilting. Okay, so I've marked it. I've marked the lines that we need to follow right here. Okay. okay. Cool? Yes. And so you're going to do this diagonally half right diagonally here, here and I'm then we'll... Go to the middle. baking cookies with my mom today. Um, it reminded me of all the times that we baked cookies together. I remember, like I said, whenever we were baking them, um, when I was in kindergarten, whenever I was going to start kindergarten, and uh, we were baking cookies, and she was kind of preparing me for what it was going to happen whenever I started school, and um, I think baking cookies just allowed us to, you know, spend time together. Um, and that's something that I've also taught my husband, um, and that's a memory I can share with him, too. Okay, so I am a true beginner on the Handy Quilter, and I've learned a lot from her, even from how to thread the machine. I've just been doing it for a few months. As far as what she's taught me, she's taught me, I think the main thing that comes to mind is patience. <laughs> she's the most patient person I've ever met in my entire life. And I, God did not give me that gift. I just want to get things done. Uh -huh. Like I don't want to plan. I don't want to talk about it. it. That's even shown up in my quilting. Like I just want to do it. I don't want to do a test block. And I'm more of the, um, by the book, give me a recipe give me a pattern to do. It's a good balance though because whenever sometimes she'll make something and she's like oh but this part is not you know how I want it to be and I'm like but look what you did like you made this whole quilt and you don't have to focus on that one thing. So I played volleyball and um, whenever I tried out in junior high, I made the B team. There was an A team and a B team, and I made the B team, and I was very unhappy about that. Devastated. And, yeah, devastated. And she got out, I wanted to practice so I could get better and get on the A team, and so she got out in the driveway with me, and I hit, she would throw it to me, and I would hit it and practice. But I became an avid fan. That's another thing I think you've taught me is, to never give up and always work hard for what you want. Mm -hmm. She was the first college graduate in her family. <laughs> that taught me, um, you know, to, to go after your dreams. And she sacrificed a lot and, you know, she taught me hard work and dedication. I never, as a kid, said that I wanted to be an accountant or a CPA, um, but I've always been really analytical. And so whenever I went to college and I started taking, I did general business, and whenever I started taking my accounting classes, I was like, whoa, I'm good at this. 
And then whenever I graduated, I went into public accounting. And yes, I was good at the work itself, but I always felt really overwhelmed. And then also something they don't teach you in college is how to deal with personalities that you're working with. You work on a team of accountants, so you have many different bosses, and then you also have people that work under you that you have to teach. So you manage from a really early age. In teaching people in public accounting, I've learned, I've definitely learned patience from my mom. Quilting definitely balances out um, my work life, but I've always needed a creative outlet. I never realized that whenever I was younger. Um, but I like, my favorite part about quilting is picking out the fabrics and putting the colors together. And then I like my completed project, what I created. I like to see that. We like to travel. New York is probably one of our favorite places to go to, just to explore different cultures that are there, and especially for the food. Probably the most fun thing that we did as a family is that we were in 4-H, and we raised pigs uh, and did fabulous with it. Kelsey is our second child. We had uh, Brant, and he was three at the time that Kelsey was born. Um, and you know we just felt so blessed that we had, had a boy and a girl and both were healthy what kelsey brought to our life is that um when we actually told her to do something as she was growing up she did it just an easy easy child i am a cpa i'm a daughter and i quilt <laughs>